hi guys welcome back to my channel hope you guys are having a wonderful day today today is actually thursday um by the time you see this video um and this video is just going to be a quick home haul um some of the stuff i'm gonna have to show you after i film this clip because i have it at the house so if you guys are interested in a home haul then keep watching mm. I made me a smoothie and it's so good. So, I'm currently in the parking lot and I just want to show you guys some of the things that I picked up today. Um, if you guys don't know, me and my husband are on our debt-free journey and we are at the stage to where we want to put down roots and we want to buy a home. So, um, we are looking for a fixer-upper. We did discuss getting a new build, but a new build is too expensive and I feel like with the new build you get build a grade you really don't get the best quality for what you're paying for so we're looking for an older home particularly a fixer-upper hopefully you know it'll just be little minor things that we tweak like light fixtures you can always switch them out but we're looking for something older but renovated or somewhat up to date but if not that is fine we'll put in the work and we'll do what we got to do to bring it up to the things that we want but I did pick up a few things and I want to show you guys what I got so the first thing that I got is these Lulu was a Rulu design flare rings um, seven rings with clips so um, I just got these that have like little clips on them um, I bought these from a antique shop for five bucks and I got two sets um, because I know that I either want to put these in the living room or in my um, or in our master bedroom. I love to sew, so I most likely will be sewing up our curtains. And then the second thing that I got is actually a steel, um, which I think it is because I have been looking for something similar to this on, um, what is it, Let Go? Is it Let Go? I think it's Let Go, um, vintage wise. And as you can see, it is a light fixture. It is a jelly light, a small exterior wall lantern. So I did want one of these, um, particularly, for the outside of our home i do love the that modern farmhouse style i love it but for me to buy a vintage one have to you know spray paint it and you know get it rewired it was seven dollars not including the cost to rewire and i'm not good with electrical i did pick up one of these i do have another one of these but i'm not sure if they're the same one i have to make sure that they're still the same dimensions if not i'm gonna have to take it back and get the other one so I got a jelly light and the other one I have is the Hampton Bay in the matte black color as well and I hope I'm hoping that the matte black color also matches up because they're two different brands and two different brands can have two different color shades regardless of the same name so I'm thinking about that but um, I'm gonna check them I'm gonna compare them and I'm gonna show you guys the other one I'm we're both gonna see if they match up so all right so now that I'm back home I'm going to take these out of the box keeping them separate so I don't get them confused um, I'm just taking out the Hampton Bay one. This is the one that I was telling you guys about that I didn't have with me when I filmed the first clip. So this is the electrical part. As you can see, it's a nice matte black color that I absolutely love. And then I'm just going to take out the second one, which is also a matte black. And as you can see, they match pretty darn good. Um, I think that they are gorgeous and for only $5.00. You can't beat that so i'm just gonna put them back in their plastic and put them to the side now i'm gonna get out the glass now with the glass you can definitely tell that it is slightly different now i thought i was just you know being picky and it was my eyes playing tricks on me but no they're actually different all right so i pulled out the glass for the hampton bay one and you know sticking it back in the plastic but then i was like you know what i think it would be better for me to pull them out and compare them side by side which you will see in a few seconds here this is the other one out of the box and this is where i was like you know something's not right so <laughs> i pulled them back out and you can just see it um the one that's in the non hampton bay box is clearer the rings are a little bit bigger in fact the whole jar is a little bit bigger and believe it or not i actually prefer the one that i recently just got versus the hampton bay one but either way it goes i'm still going to use both of them they're good still and i would highly recommend them and i will have them linked down below so if you guys want to do like a quick 
home reno for the cheap for the low low i will put that down there so you guys can check it out and i will just you know put these back and put them away and save these for my and my family's future home and i'm super super excited to take you guys on this journey like you just don't know like i'm super super excited but i'm gonna put this away now and i'm gonna show you guys the other things that i purchased which is some rust-oleum stainer and polyurethane and some waverly's chalk paint. all right you guys so i just realized that i did not film an outro for this video and i just wanted to pop on here and say thank you so much for watching and we are going to be on a new journey um house hunting and all of that stuff we are super super blessed and super super thankful that you know we're at this point in our lives so if you guys are interested and want to you know just tag along then keep watching but um until then i'll catch you guys in the next video and have a good day and have a great weekend and bye you guys